Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for April the 17th of 2021. Well, it is titled Inside the Flame Nebula. So what do we see here? Well, this is a part of the constellation Orion and a star forming region known as the Flame Nebula. Now we see this just towards the edge of the belt of Orion. And it's a relatively young area. And we look at the stars here in just maybe a few hundred thousand years to a million years old. So we can see that they're just in the process of forming. And the flame nebula is the material around them a part of the material from which these form. So it's part of the large molecular cloud from which they would have formed uh, that long ago. Now that time while it may seem long to us is relatively short compared to the lifespan of a star. Many stars like our own sun will live for 10 billion years. So to them, a couple hundred thousand or even a million years is a very short period of time. For some of the more massive stars, that's a good fraction of their life that may only live a few million years. So we see those here and one of the things that we look at in this is that we are looking into the flame nebula and how we can look inside a nebula is by using infrared radiation. The dust within a nebula blocks out the light from stars inside. So if we looked at this in ordinary visible light, we would not be able to see anything. Uh, we'd be able to see the nebula, but the stars themselves would be well hidden down at the core. By using infrared, in this case from the Spitzer Space Telescope, we can look inside the nebula and actually see that cluster of stars that is forming within the nebula. And this these kind of studies are helping us to better understand the process of star formation. Now one of the problems with star formation is that it takes a long time and it takes hundreds of thousands to millions of years for stars to form within a cluster like this. So even though we see some stars that are forming here the process is still ongoing. Now what we had thought the models of star formation would say that it would start towards the center of a molecular cloud but we're getting a little bit more of a stellar nursery here that we see and it tells us we really need some kind of more complex model to be able to understand things. So as is typical with science we will start out of course with the simplest explanation and then add to it as we get more and more data that allow us to understand better what is actually happening and gives us a better picture of the universe. So that was our picture of the day for April the 17th of 2021. It was titled Inside the Flame Nebula. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be air glow rainbow. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone and I will see you in class.